United States has the most confirmed cases of the coronavirus out of any country in the world, with over 160,000 cases and over 3,000 deaths, with 1,200 of those being from New York. Due to this, President Trump made an announcement extending the social distancing guidelines to April 30th, which is almost two weeks later than the initial April 14th date. This statement was made just hours after Governor Cuomo said that the efforts would continue until the 15th. President Trump also said that the virus will most likely peak around Easter and wishes to continue quarantines until after that point. World Health Organization officials are advising people not to wear masks, especially those that would be used in hospitals, unless you are sick or are caring for someone who is. Dr. Mike Ryan, the executive director of the WHO Health Emergencies Program, said that there is no evidence to suggest that wearing masks stops the spread of the disease and that the evidence only points to the opposite if the masks are misused or do not fit properly. There is also a mask global shortage of masks, so not using them allows them to be used by medical professionals who need them in hospitals. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, ESM. I'm here with the rat that I found in my toilet this morning. Uh, my phone is propped up with toilet paper and a shoe that I'm not wearing because it's been raining out a lot. This is what it's come to. Back to the depths with you. This past Saturday, Governor Andrew Cuomo announced that New York State schools would remain closed until at least April 15th. This extends further than his original announcement of April 1st. ESM schools were already planning on staying closed until April 13th. <sighs> Time is running out to complete your, your work for the third marking period. This Friday marks the end of the marking period. Please reach out to your teachers if you have any questions. Do you play sports? Send a spring sports picture of you practicing at home or working out to dbaker at esmschools.org. That is dbaker at esmschools.org. They are finishing up the yearbook now, so this is your chance. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Or don't. I'm not your dad. I'm not in your house. I can't tell you what to do. I don't even know if there's going to be a Pledge of Allegiance. I don't know. The whole thing has thrown me out of... <sighs> for the majority of the day, however, it will be mostly cloudy throughout the day. The high for today will be 51 and a low of 35. The sun should return tomorrow with a high of 46 and a low of 33. Thursday will have more cloud coverage with a high of 46 and a low of 37. Friday will have some occasional sun and a high of 53 and a low of 39. Saturday looks a lot like Friday with a high of 57 and a low of 42. Sunday brings more rain with a high of 60 and a low of 42. I'm Amber with your weather. Due to the COVID-19 outbreak, pretty much all sports have been canceled, but the NFL has been keeping things going due to players leaving and joining new teams. Tom Brady has recently left the Patriots and has signed a two-year contract with Tampa Bay. In other news, the Section 3 sports are still canceled until further notice. I'm Isabel with your sports.